drum alert nation i'm your host kevlar keemstar let's go right into the news logan paul makes fousey tube furious we got that story for you also we now know that logan paul is dating another celebrity we got that for you and speaking about celebrities james charles uh went off on this celebrity also tank we're talking about deji's dog that was rumored to be put to sleep. Well, we got an update for that. The Nelk boys get exposed for hiring actors in their videos. Well, we got that story for you. Nikita Dragon started a whole lot of trouble insinuating that she was hooking up with these celebrities. Is it true? We'll find out. Dr. Disrespect and Tim the Tap Man are in a thumbnail war. We also got J Station up. Uh, returning addison ray calls it quits and much much more but before we get into the news guys make sure you subscribe with those notifications on because you know as soon as i get the scoop i'm gonna keep you in the loop for our very first story megan fox was looking like a complete 10 at the vmas the quartering said that she looks plastic like a, a walking doll like way too much plastic surgery stop this madness she's gross whoa calling megan fox gross from the quartering i i wonder what the quartering looks like you know the guy that made this tweet he looks like this <laughs> calling megan fox gross really but speaking about mtv's vmas one musical star is calling it quits that's right we are talking about addison ray you know she had a couple songs out hit songs uh, that's right, she posted on Instagram that after a lot of thinking, she's not gonna perform at iHeart. Cause I wanna give my fans 110% and I don't feel like I'm ready to do that. Thank you for your understanding and support. Love y'all. Ooh, that's some red flags. All right, listen, okay. If you're gonna make music, you gotta be able to perform your music. And speaking about performing, I'm not sure if this next performance is reality or a stunt by the now banned YouTuber J Station, cause he recently tweeted out this. We better get the highest viewed Dr. Phil episode ever, showing that he's dressed up, kinda looking like Dr. Phil. Is J Station really going on Dr. Phil? If he does, I'm watching that episode. I am watching that episode. In fact, there was this whole documentary being made on J Station from these two YouTubers, Colossal is Crazy and Nerd City. They've been working on it since February of the year 2020. It's now September 2021. So where is that J Station documentary? Go, go hit them up on social media and tell them to hurry up. Also in the news, two Twitch streamers that are now YouTube streamers, Dr. Disrespect and Tim the Tapman are going at it. Dr. Disrespect tweeted at Tim the Tapman saying, what the H-E double hockey sticks is this? Showing a thumbnail of Tim the Tapman carrying Dr. Disrespect, you know, carrying him in the game. Tim said, what? Dr. Disrespect said, don't worry, I won't retaliate. And then today, there was in fact a retaliation as Dr. Disrespect put out his new thumbnail of him carrying Tim the Tap Man and courage. And speaking about courage, it must have taken some courage for Harry Styles to wear that. No, not that, that, that no, I'm not talking about the dress thing. No, 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 this. Because tell me if I'm mistaken, but isn't that like the outfit of Miranda Sings? <laughs> now listen, I wasn't the only one that thought this. In fact, Miranda started trending on Twitter because many people thought like, yeah, he's dressing up like her. The actress that plays Miranda Sings said, <laughs> what is happening? And speaking about what is happening, okay, Nikita Dragon, you know, she's a transgender YouTuber, popular uh, on TikTok popular beauty influencer. She recently came out with this music video called D-I-C-K. Now listen, the whole premise of this music video is that straight guys are into transgender girls, but they want it to be a secret. They don't want the world to know because they don't want to be judged. And in this music video, she's exposing some very famous uh, straight males for uh, apparently being into her, but not wanting the world to know. She shows a picture of her and Vinny Hacker. She shows this picture of, uh, that it would be uh, Harry Josie. And then she shows this screenshot in the music video that Tyga, yeah, the rapper Tyga is saying, text me. She posted on the gram that she's the first trans pop star. No, okay, Tyga was not having it. 
he responded on Twitter saying this. My company shot and directed a music video for her a while back and never dropped it. So I'm not sure why she added my likeness to this. Well, I'm gonna ask uh, you guys. You believe in Tyga? <laughs> but speaking about believing, there are more allegations on YouTubers out there in the world. And these allegations are against the Nelk Boys for apparently faking their pranks with paid actors. This is the TikTok that went viral exposing the Nelk Boys. Let me know what you think. Roll it. I'm proving the Nelk Boys are fake. This is their last video. Look at this. None of these people are paid actors. This is their main ghost hunter. American Horror Story Season 1, Episode 3, 8 minutes and 26 seconds into the episode. And there is their main ghost hunter. If you want more verification that it's him, he's got a flute case. And it's the same flute case from the video, too. Look at, look at, okay. Now, they filmed this in LA, and basically Kyle from the Nelk Boys, he came out with a video saying, look guys, you know, we do Craigslist ads to like to when we're gonna troll people or pull pranks on them and whatnot, and everybody is an actor in LA, so you know, we just basically stumbled across someone that was an actor, we're gonna have to do more research, but the whole thing was not fake. It was not fake, he's not a paid actor, that's not how this went down, but I'm gonna bring it off to you guys. Do you think the Nelk boys, you know, planned this, had fake actors, or do you think this was just a, a coincidence? Also in the news, Tank. Uh, Deji's dog, Tank. It bit a neighbor. They went to court. You guys know this story. Big, long fiasco that happened. And uh, the last we heard is that the original dog, Tank, was put down from biting the neighbor and after court and the police and all that. But apparently... Tank is still alive. That's right, Deji and KSI's parents said that the old Tank is not dead. It was my neighbor that insisted that the police should take him away, so I guess the police have got him or have given him away. I mean, this is a very sad story, but I mean, I feel so much better that the dog was not put down. But speaking about being put down, James Charles once said in the past that the rudest celebrity that he ever came across was Ariana Grande. Why did he say that? I don't know. A fan said to James Charles, what did Ariana Grande do for you to say that she's the rudest celebrity you ever met? James responded by saying literally nothing. The fact that I said that is one of the biggest regrets of my career. Whoa! The fact that he said that Ariana Grande was rude is one of the biggest regrets of his career? What about the 14 year old, the 16 year old? <laughs> and now ladies and gentlemen, it's time for our final story. Logan Paul is dating someone famous. That's right, we are talking about Olivia O'Brien. The two of them have been caught together in public multiple times, but it all became crystal clear on the BFFs podcast. Watch this, Rollis. But like, so what are you, like, what are you doing there? He's just like, wh where do you live? Okay. Who, wh where do you live, Olivia? I don't have all my travel. She lives in Los what? Angeles. She and She's a friend of ours, a longtime friend of ours. Uh, and what, like, what, what, why are you there? Just hanging out? Are you just yes. giving us like a stomach view? What is going on? Yeah, what is happening? Who else is there? Yeah, she said Who else is there? So it's Mike, Dave, Olivia. Dave, she's there for she yeah, said. We I'm figured it out. What? I'm here as a member of the Logan. Logan <laughs> gang. All right. So like King Logan, is that it? Um, yeah, sure. Okay. Fine. That's, Sick. That's wow, an answer, okay. at least. So you guys, there's you guys there's wanted, you guys wanted tea. You got <laughs> there's a headline. That's that is awesome. And for our final, final story, why is Logan Paul making FouseyTube absolutely furious? Because of this! <laughs> That's right, Logan's been hanging out with Drake. That new Drake album, Certified Lover Boy, is uh, is the jam, so make sure you check out that. But that's it, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for the news today. Guys, make sure you subscribe with those notifications on, because you know, as soon as I get the scoop, I'm gonna keep you in the loop.